All right, just a little note here. I was fishing with a lot of people that were down there. I didn't see anybody catch fish. So I'm not trying to brag at all. But if you don't listen or take heed what I'm saying, I'm telling you, you're going to end up being like those guys that did not catch anything. And they've been there all day, all morning, all afternoon, and they didn't pull in anything. So with that said, Just use the setup and cast it as far as you can. Um, not in the middle of the lake. You're going all the way to the left side where the outlet is. And you're going to see very shallow water for about 30 feet out. You gotta cast past that. You're gonna see a really big drop in just dark water. That's where you want to cast, okay? And if you're thinking, hey Nick, where on the left side, how, how close to the left side of that area do you want me to be? And I would say probably about 30 feet out from the left side. So if you're casting, cast past the shallow 30 feet from the left side. Don't get too close because there's a lot of um, toolies or, or, or just a lot of grass growing. So if you, if you end up 10 feet, 15 feet, uh, to the left, you're going to end up being in this really thick grass. You'll end up snagging and losing everything. So about 30 feet. So I hope that helps. If it does, please put a thumbs up uh, and let me know. All right. Let me get it out real quick. Now, these are the mice tails right here. By Powerbait, Berkeley. You see that? Yeah. Okay. All you're doing is running a size 11 hook or 10 right on the tip, right here. Just run it right through it like a loop and just let it hang, okay? All you have to do is run a size 10 hook on this about a three to four feet lead line and a water bobber. Now the water bobber looks like this right here, okay? You can find them in any fishing store. These are the water bobbers right here. You fill them up with water, you make sure it's completely full. And then, yeah, you put it on the rig, just like a Carolina rig, like a egg weight. Just use it like that. So you have the, the line coming down, you got this on the line, then you got a swivel, and then you got another line going down about three, four feet, and then you got your uh, mice tail. You got this mice tail hooked up with a size 10 hook right on the white part okay just loop it okay give enough so when fish bite it actually catches the barb and gets the fish so that worked really well for me over here at silver lake sierra nevada this is really nice this is really really nice here so anyways next
Oh yeah, there it is. Oh, what a good day at Silver Lake. We just got cloud covering, which is a good thing. So, anyways, I've only caught two on a water bobber and pink, white, mice tail. Don't forget the head's got to be white, the body's pink. So, beautiful, beautiful day. I've only been out here a couple hours, so since the covering of the clouds, I'm getting cold. So, I might wrap it up, go get my coffee or something. But, anyways. I'm dragging the bottom. Check it out. Oh, yeah. There it is. There's my little setup. All right, guys. I had a really good time over here at Silver Lake, and I just want to let you know that I ended up catching five trout. Um, somebody said it was going to be really hard. I found it pretty pretty easy. Um, I did try uh, a little bit of jigging with uh, grasshopper color. It didn't work, so I switched over to mice tail. Used the pink. The bubble gum with the white head um, that was really working well and end up catching three on the float tube which is right here right next to me and two on the shoreline so overall in three hours five fish not bad so i had a good time And another thing, I just want to let you guys know that um, a good friend of mine gave me this float tube for free. He absolutely, I just, it was, it was an awe. I thank you very much, Daryl, for giving me this float tube. I am using it. I am trying to abuse it. I am going to keep using it and have fun. And hopefully I can pass it to somebody else. But it is a wonderful float tube. I love this thing. It is perfect. So... Thank you very much, and I appreciate you. All right.